Greetings, esteemed viewers. Today we embark on an enlightening odyssey into the life, philosophy, and enduring wisdom of Metrodorus of Lampsacus, a luminary in the vast tapestry of ancient Greek philosophy. Born in the bustling city of Lampsacus around 331 BCE, Metrodorus would rise to prominence as a key figure in the Epicurean school of thought. Join us as we unravel the layers of his life, delve into the philosophical currents that shaped his worldview, and contemplate the timeless lessons he left for posterity. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and share your reflections with us in the comments below. Early Life and Influences A journey begins Metrodorus's philosophical journey commenced in the vibrant city of Lampsacus, situated along the Hellespont. His formative years were guided by the intellectual influence of his father, Athenaeus, and his teacher, none other than the renowned Epicurus himself. Under their guidance, Metrodorus embarked on a profound exploration of the philosophical realms that would define his life's trajectory. Founding the Epicurean Garden, Nurturing Wisdom, in 306 BCE, Metrodorus, alongside Epicurus and other kindred spirits, played a pivotal role in the establishment of the Epicurean Garden in Athens. This sanctuary of philosophical discourse became a haven for those seeking not just knowledge but a profound understanding of the principles that could lead to a tranquil and content life. The Epicurean Garden, with Metrodorus as one of its luminaries, stood as a testament to the transformative power of philosophical community. Epicurean philosophy unveiled a quest for tranquility, at the core of Metrodorus' philosophical endeavors lay Epicureanism, a school of thought that championed the teachings of Epicurus. The Epicureans, guided by principles that transcended the superficial pursuit of pleasure, advocated for a life of tranquility and the pursuit of genuine happiness. Friendship, simple living, and the cultivation of intellectual pleasures formed the bedrock of their philosophical framework. Hedonism, redefined, the prudent pursuit of pleasure. Contrary to common misconceptions about hedonism, Epicurean philosophy, as articulated by Metrodorus, was not a call for unrestrained indulgence. Instead, it entailed the prudent pursuit of simple pleasures that contributed to the absence of pain and the serenity of the soul. Metrodorus emphasized the intellectual pleasures derived from meaningful connections and the avoidance of unnecessary deseris that could disturb one's inner peace. The wise men's path, autarkeia, and self-sufficiency metrodorus, in alignment with Epicurus, propagated the concept of autarkeia, self-sufficiency. The wise person, according to Metrodorus, finds contentment within themselves, free from dependency on external circumstances for happiness. This principle underscores the idea that genuine fulfillment comes from cultivating an inner state of tranquility. Legacy of Letters Fragments of Wisdom While the written works of Metrodorus are scarce, fragments of his letters and sayings provide valuable insights into his philosophical musings. His emphasis on the pursuit of a tranquil life and the profound value of friendships left an indelible mark on the Epicurean tradition. Through these fragments, we catch glimpses of a philosopher who sought to illuminate the path to a life well-lived. Death and Beyond, A Philosophical Legacy in 277 BCE, Metrodorus departed from the material world, but his philosophical legacy endured. His contributions, alongside those of his sister Metrodora, continued to shape the trajectory of Epicureanism. The impact of Metrodorus's teachings transcended his temporal existence, becoming a guiding light for those navigating the complexities of life. Enduring Wisdom, Tranquility in Simplicity in essence, Metrodorus's enduring wisdom lies in the simplicity of Epicureanism, the pursuit of a life free from unnecessary worries, the fostering of meaningful connections, and the savoring of intellectual pleasures that lead to a content and tranquil existence. His philosophy serves as a timeless guide for those seeking a path to genuine happiness amid life's uncertainties. Embracing Tranquility in conclusion, 
Metrodorus of Lampsacus emerges not only as a key figure in Epicurean philosophy, but as a beacon guiding individuals toward a life of tranquility. As we reflect on his teachings, may we find inspiration in the pursuit of genuine happiness, meaningful connections, and the wisdom to navigate life's complexities with equanimity. Thank you for accompanying us on this intellectual journey into the world of Metrodorus's philosophy. If you've discovered value in our exploration, I invite you to subscribe, hit the like button, and share your reflections. Until our next philosophical venture, may the spirit of Epicurean tranquility accompany your path.